animate line spacing. Go to your settings. Set your screen size, timeline frame rate, and your playback frame rate. Hit save, right click on media pool, new fusion composition, give it a name. hit create drag it down to your timeline go to your fusion tab click on text go ahead and join your text one to media out and then drag your text one to the viewer and put your text in Okay, and I'm going to change mine from bold to regular. I'm going to change my color to yellow. I'm going to increase the size. To 1.2. Tracking up a little. Okay. One point four. Okay. So, well, let's go with one point three. Okay, that looks a lot better. And now we can get ready to animate. Um, go ahead and right click on the line spacing and hit animate or hit this little diamond right here I'm going to go halfway through the clip and increase the line spacing to 2.9 Then hit enter. I'm going to go to the end of the clip. And bring it back down real close. And that's 0.63. Okay. I'll just hit enter on that. Press play. Okay. I'll smooth it out. Open your spline and click on text one. Hit fit and choose those three points that you're looking at. And hit S or you can smooth it right here. I'm here in the corner. Okay, we're at the beginning of the clip. So, you need to make a nice curve. Okay, bring that point out and connect it. And go to the end of your clip, pull this point out and connect it. You believe that? Called keyframes, whatever I call them points. Okay, so hit play. Okay. 
All right, cool. Close your spline, and you're ready to render. In case you don't know, this little rocket ship or whatever it is right here is you go there to render. No. That's the end of the video. And thanks for watching.